even get to go Hey, what's going on Guardians? My name's Erupt and welcome back to another Destiny video. Now in today's video, I'm probably going to put this out just for the simple reason that a lot of people just like myself really doubt this weekend at Trials. Mainly because there's no radar and mainly because there is no revives. Now of course I'm playing in Clash right here just because I'm in private matches to show you the strategies of this map and why it's actually a really easy map to play. In terms of easiness, it all comes down to basically your gun skill and map awareness in general. Now I will say that one thing is that audio really does come into play with this, so if you don't have a very good headset this may become slightly harder, but do be sure to have your game volume up somewhat so you can be able to play this map a lot better. Now we're going to go to the main call lights first. Okay, so here we have Alpha Spawn, you can just call this A Spawn. Now this is going to have platforms, so you can just call these A platforms. These are going to be rushed down the left side or right side, depending which way you're coming from. Alpha side, it'll be left, and of course Bravo, it'll be right. Now here we have Green Platform, and then this whole room in general is just called Green, mainly because of its distinct green hue that is just cast over the entire area. We also have a tunnel, which is just a little connector from the spawn all the way into Green, and a very quick method if the Alpha team want to run there very quickly. Kind of sounded like Marina Joyce where I repeated myself there a few times. So here we have blue. Now this is again, it's literally just called blue because it's blue. Yeah, as you can see, it's got a circle. Uh, the heavy doesn't spawn here. In fact, the special does spawn here in Trials of Osiris, so keep that in mind. So yeah, as you notice here, there are four entry points to this entire room. Now this isn't exactly one of the most vital areas for using audio to pick up where the enemy are, but I guess the water could be used if someone is running over it to try and track where they are. But just in general, remember this room's got four entry points, so be sure to know which ones the enemy are coming from by using call lights from your teammates. Now this next room is called orange, again, because of the color orange being the main factor of it. Now remember people can back off and be quite sneaky, pop these doors open and then snipe into the middle circle. I'm just going to go over that call out in a bit but just for now remember this is where the whole orange area is. So here we have Bravo spawn as you can see it's just on the connector and you can have a good sight over to gunfights with alpha spawn. Now I'm going to go over that at the end as well because there's a little note about that it's really going to affect the way of the game. Okay, so now we're in the main area of the entire map. Now this is called Circle. Now it could be the easiest or the hardest part of the map to play depending on your awareness. As you can see, we've got one, two, three, four, and five doors. Now all these doors can open and they actually do make a sound when you open them. Now that's where the audio comes in. You can use these to constantly keep track of where the enemies are. Of course, if your teammates aren't giving you call lights or you're completely ignoring where your teammates are, this does become slightly more of a challenge, but this room is quite easy to hold off as if you just have a shotgun out, you're going to have a great time just tracking where the enemies are coming through and it's easy to play behind doors because the more you bait with emotes or use emotes to look around corners, you can have a much wider view of where these enemies are coming from. Again, let's just put a little tip here, this is where heavy will spawn, there's only one heavy in trials now, so this is where it will be spawning this week, so just keep an eye out on that, again this room is going to be very important in that round, so be sure to be the first team to get in there quick and get those picks off. Now this place is simply just called bridge, mainly because it's a bridge separating the alpha spawn from the Bravo spawn and you will notice that these two platforms are kind of facing each other. Now whoever is up here first has got to make sure that they're confident in their skill and can actually get the kills up there. If they know there's an enemy there, get out of there as soon as possible, make sure not to drop down as they can still pick you off, but try and run on the inside and hopefully escape the enemy's gunfire. This is kind of why I don't recommend this side as it is a much harder side to play unless you're on peak with your gun skill. Now map awareness can win you these games even if you're not the greatest of Trials players. That's why this map is actually really easy and can apply to just about any player. But as long as you have a good knowledge with your teammates of what you're going to be calling these areas, then get them to watch this video and you'll all be on the same page. You'll all know which callouts are which and then you'll be able to call out enemies much much quicker, know where the heavies are and know where the safest places are to be. Make sure you don't fall for anyone's bait and make sure that as a team you know where each other are. There's nothing worse than turning around and ignoring someone's game attack and then starting to shoot at your teammate as you can give your position away and you will be very light to the enemies who are also using headphones. And a good thing to also have is if you are playing as a warlock, do what I've done and play as a self res. Self res warlocks basically they can revive themselves so that is a great way to come back without the revive feature. If you did enjoy today's video then please be sure to leave a like, tell me if I went in depth enough or if there's anything else you want to know about Trials of Osiris tips and this map in general and I'll be sure to comment down below. Be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, share this on social media for more Destiny tips, tricks, news and updates in the community. My name's been Erupt and have a great day.